Well, I made it to Gas Axe Chop Shop. Have you ever seen so many good looking Chevy trucks? First, I should start off with this 59. I kind of pan around, of course, that's a big turd. And I made it over here just fine. Didn't give a lick of problems. That's the furthest I've drove it, probably drove it 20 miles, I guess, 15, 20, somewhere in that neighborhood. Ran perfect. I have a friend that Tim is working on his uh, this aluminum Chevy van. Looks like we got some company coming in. Might have to make this video pretty short. But uh, I don't know what all he's having done to it, but it's an older van, like from the 60s, maybe early 70s. Of course, it's a Chevrolet. I'm not going to open the door because I didn't ask. But I'll let you look at the insides if I can show them to you. There's another van he was working on for a customer, but I think he's uh, going to. I don't know when he's going to get back on. It all depends on funds. That's the same way with me. You don't see these too much either. Jeep Wagoneers. Those are really popular now. They used to be a dime a dozen, but you don't see them much anymore. Uh, I hear that they're quite valuable. And that Dennis Collins that comes on uh, fast and loud every once in a while, he's into these too. He's always looking for these. And I think they're pretty high dollar. As I said, I don't know whose this is. First time I've seen it as well. Got the wood grain going on. You don't see them very often. Pretty cool vehicle. I don't know why it's here or what's getting done to it, but pretty straight old vehicle. Okay, I'll get back with you in just a minute. 